1996 was a long time ago, but there have been certain actors that have forever left The Jamie Foxx Show. Even though Jamie Foxx made a breakthrough with one of the hit shows that aired in the late 90s and early 2000s, we're going to be paying tribute to some of those actors that are no longer with us. So without any further ado, here are the 10 actors that were on Jamie Foxx's show and died in real life. Let's dive right into it, shall we? Number 10, Michael Taliferro. I'll just take, I'll just take a melon slice. Cool, melon slice, watch your way, that's good. And the chicken sandwich, the T-bone steak, the seafood platter. He was big, but he was funny. We know him for his intimidating stature from the show, and you could call him somewhat of a regular. But sadly, this sportsman, actor, and even singer, that's right, this guy sang, has left us on May 4th, 2006. What caused his death at the young age of just 44? A stroke ended his life. Number 9. Thomas Michael Ford I, I, don't, I don't know what you were doing. I was looking for a number in my address book. You have an address book? May I see it? On the show, he played a guy named Marcus, while also being a regular on several other shows. For example, he was part of the hilarious Fox sitcom Martin for five years until 1997. And we can't forget his role as Mel Parker in the sitcom The Parkers. All of a sudden, he suffered from a ruptured abdominal aneurysm that proved to be fatal. Just a quick heads up, for number six, we have a guy that has passed away just a few months ago. So make sure you keep watching to find out who that was. Number eight, Helen Martin. All right, guys. What happened, Jamie? Did they cancel? No, instead of 12 o'clock, they need to pause at 11 o'clock. That's no problem. She was one of the most experienced cast members on the show. The reason we're saying this is because this little lady smashed that like button just like you should if you haven't done so already. But no, it's because she had had a career spanning for over 50 years when she joined the show. And because Helen lived a fairly long life, she passed away on March 25th, 2000. She was 90 at the time. Number 7. Buck Cartalian he appeared in this first season of The Jamie Foxx Show, and he had a minor role as Rutherford B. White. At the time they shot the movie, Buck was already 74. And can you believe that this elderly actor actually lived for two more decades after appearing on the show? That's right, he died in the year 2016. Number 6. Tommy Lister Jr. Miss Payne. Yeah. At that vacuum, is there anything else you might need? No, Apollo, thank you, that'll be fine. And here's the famed number six we talked about. As we already said, Tommy Lister Jr. died a few months ago. At the age of 62, Tommy passed away on December 10th, 2020 in California. And yes, if you liked old school wrestling, there's a big chance you might have seen him in the ring. Number five, Michael Clark Duncan. This is one of the actors that needs no introduction. His iconic role as John Coffey in The Green Mile has become a movie classic. On the show, he was also featured as one of the inmates of Jamie Foxx in one episode of the first season. Sadly, Michael died back in 2012, only 54 years old. Now, make sure you watch till the end to find out which actor and music legend is no longer with us today. Number 4. Christoph St. John Have you ever watched The Young and the Restless? Well, this is the guy that played Neil Winters for about two decades. Sadly, his untimely death meant that we would be saying goodbye with an iconic actor. And while he was preoccupied with his main show, he still found ways to incorporate himself in other shows like The Jamie Foxx Show in 1997. Number 3. Obi and Defo Don't start panicking. This actor is not dead. So what the hell are we doing including him on this list? We're glad you asked. You see, Bodie Wells from Dawson's Creek has survived a fatal car accident while at the supermarket, and he had both his legs amputated in 2019. So we will just take this opportunity and pay homage to a man that never gave up. Number 2. Gerald Levert Here's the legendary singer we talked about. He became active in the late 70s and then, when the Jamie Foxx show rolled around, he and the star of the show shared a beautiful musical moment on the set. And yes, Gerald passed away really young at the age of just 40. Number 1. Jerry Gray as our number one pick, we've decided to include Jerry Gray, the elderly lady that was featured in the pilot of the show and who has managed to land roles on shows like Martin, The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, Shortcuts, and many more. Just one year after the show aired on August 8, 1997, Jerry passed away at the age of 72. On a related note, which of these actors did you love the most? You can tell us in the comment section below. If you'd like more videos like these, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so you never miss any of them. And as always, thanks for watching, guys.